Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel and to another reaction video. Right, today I'm going to be reacting to the new official trailer for Dune that was just released. And uh, looks like Nala would like to participate in this reaction, is here to join me, as she often is. But um, yeah, so this was just released. Uh, it's probably going to take me a couple days to get it up, unfortunately, but I really don't want to wait to watch it, so we're going to record right now. I've been a huge fan of Dune for many years. I've got one of my well well read <laughs> copies of the the original, the primary text that I've read multiple times. Um, and you know, there's a lot of different books in in this series that continues forward. Um, the Dune Chronicles, and I have read all of the original Dune Chronicles um, at least once, a couple of them twice, this the first book I've read multiple, multiple times, and I've seen the original film, I've seen the, I actually haven't just seen, but I have <laughs> an old DVD copy of the sci-fi miniseries that I watched a lot when I was a kid, so needless to say, this is a, a <laughs> A story that I am a big fan of and I'm hopeful excited about this you know uh, nervous because you never know what's gonna happen but I'm just gonna hope for the best you know they got one of the best directors they possibly could the cast sounds great so far so all right Nala you want to check this out you want to check out this trailer with me all right let's let's just let's get into it let's watch it keep our fingers crossed. Okay, here we go. My planet Arrakis is so beautiful when the sun is low. Jamie. Rolling over the sand, you can see spice in the air. Mm. The outsiders ravage our lands in front of our eyes. Mm. It's time. 
favorite music! Okay, so... Nala seems to have left. I was not paying sufficient attention to her. I was too enraptured by what I was seeing. Um, so, first of all, the music was fantastic. Um, very atmospheric, very much kind of the tone and feel that I would hope for, and especially when it got to the end there, um, I, I guess it kind of just hit, hit the right, right spot for me. Um, the cast has, has always been a huge plus for me since they first started releasing names of who was playing who. I was like, okay, yes, that sounds great. That sounds great. That sounds great. But, you know, actually seeing them um, together interacting just kind of reaffirms that to me and get my hopes up even higher. Some of the characters, it seems like you'd really have to work hard to find a person that could pull it off. Um, I think one of the reasons that it's been possibly maybe so hard to, to try and put together an adaptation of this is because you really need the right kind of person to play Paul and there aren't really a ton of actors out there that really fit that and I think that he does. Um, so we'll see, we'll hope for the best. Lady Jessica is also extremely crucial and I think Rebecca Ferguson is an amazing casting choice and she has that right just kind of like mysterious sort of dangerous <laughs> I don't know a feel to her and even in the way she speaks it just it sounds like she will be perfectly able to to present the voice if you guys know Dune you know what I mean um Zendaya I think she's a great choice for Chaney um but even even like Characters that we didn't see really represented here as much, like uh, Javier Bardem is playing Stilgar, that's nuts. I'm curious to see more of him in the future. We see a lot of Jason Momoa in here, they're really, really pushing Duncan. I do think it's interesting um, the way they've chosen to do it and that they're not kind of like explicitly talking about this. You know, you don't see like a part one attached to it in any of the, in any of the, um, the media. But this is clearly like they're just doing the first half of the story about approximately in this film. So this film would have to do well for us to get the second half. And so it's not fully complete. And I think you can kind of tell that from the promotional material from the trailer, even though they're not explicitly saying it. If you've read the books, you know, any of the material just by how much emphasis is placed on certain characters who aren't necessarily around at certain points later and this is obviously an earlier timeline in the story and some of the things that take up a lot of the story later on are not really shown or emphasized in any sort of way or much at all. I'm curious, one character that we haven't really seen and I haven't heard anything about casting is Piter. Um, I mean and also Princess Irulan, but Piter in particular obviously is going to have a significant role and I kind of wonder if they're saving him to even cast for a second movie or if this is going to be like a surprise when he shows up um, or maybe you guys know maybe there is somebody that's been cast and I just hadn't heard about it um, yeah and then of course like some of some of the the really interesting things that happen much later in the story I mean of course Alia who I won't spoil who she is if you guys don't know the story but is is a very strange and interesting character that comes to be significant so i i very curious about how that's going to play out if they go to a second one but for now for this part i'm really optimistic i'm hopeful everything looks good it feels right <sighs> But you know trailers can be deceiving, so I just have to like, please, please be good, please be good, please. Um, and please, I hope that it's good and that people go to see it so that we can get the whole story eventually filmed and put together. So this is going to be out on HBO Max, and my plan will probably be to watch and react on HBO Max as I, I tend to do. And then also to try and go out and see it in the theater, preferably in IMAX, because this is made for IMAX. I don't know if I'll actually be able to do that, but maybe you gotta hope for the best by the time October rolls around. Maybe I'll have an opportunity to do that again, but 
I'm just really excited. I'm really hopeful. So I hope you guys are too. Let me know what you think, how you feel about this. Are you looking forward to it? Are you optimistic or just terrified or what? Um, and you plan on seeing it in the theaters? Maybe seeing it more than one place? What are your thoughts? All right. Thank you guys so much for joining me and hopefully I will see you next time. Bye.